So what is narcissistic abuse? I know it's very much talked about narcissist. Oh, he's a narcissist. She's a narcissist. But what is really narcissistic abuse? Okay. It's emotional abuse from someone with narcissistic personality disorder. And what is that? Narcissistic personality disorder. MPD is a chronic mental illness that can cause problems in many areas of life, including relationships, work, and finances. It's characterized by a lifelong pattern of exaggerated feelings of self-importance, importance, um, an excessive need for admiration, and a diminished ability to empathize. So low empathy plus superiority complex equals toxic behavior. They manipulate with insults, threats, and accusations. I do know somebody that just, when you when they can't get their way, they insult you in a way that is so in your face that is actually, to be honest, it's actually comical to me because I'm like, you're really trying hard to get a rise out of me. And it's not working. They manipulate with insults, threats. Oh my gosh, the threats. Yes, the threats and accusations. Okay, let me tell you one thing about the accusations that I personally believe. When a narcissist accuses you, their accusations are actually confessions. Agreed on if you're around bad people and they're doing things like causing you stress, mm -hmm, you're more than likely going to get sick. Those are facts, aren't okay. they, Dave? So this they is my are... Buddha with booty t-shirts for women. I have for men, I have mugs and all that. Okay, so look at this. Release them with love, then put them on your shit list. How do you like that, guys? Let me know how you like that. If you want that t-shirt, by the way, you can get it in my store, uh, the State of Grace shop. So it's uh, release them with love and then put them on your shit list. I That's my MO nowadays. And let me tell you, uh, it works. What narcissistic abuse looks like in a relationship. So it seems like narcissistic abuse is not formally recognized uh, diagnosis, which is very interesting. It is often used to describe a syndrome where being in a relationship to a narcissistic partner can adversely affect one's emotional health. No kidding. To begin the healing process, first you have to identify the instances of abuse. This can be harder okay, than I it sounds. This. Abuse okay. from a narcissist is extremely, extremely manipulative and controlling. Because of their low frustration tolerance, they can explode and become very emotionally and verbally abusive. They frequently gaslight and put you down. Yes, they do. And you know what I found in my experience that narcissists are really incredibly insecure people. And that's why they, you know, feel that they have to be in control and put you down through verbal, emotional, and sometimes, unfortunately, physical abuse. That we can use our um, negative experience and um, traumatic experience to heal and help others. That's, I think, the biggest gift to your fellow humans. Buy my book on the stateofgraceshop.com if you are going through a breakup, and it, this book is a humorous guide to deal with the breakup aftermath. Stateofgraceshop.com. You can get it there and it's going to help. I know that the people that bought it, they're like thanking me and sending me emails like, oh my God, it helped me so much. <laughs>